Hello, my name is Ek uh, Lok Tin Yong and uh, this is my website. Today I will start a new playlist which is the Feng Shui Tips um, to answer your questions and when I think of something you know uh, good to you I will you know uh, do a separate video and post and today's question was asked by someone say how to place the cash register in a shop um, there are rules but uh, before we going into the rules is uh, because I don't know, you know what kind of shop you have like it's a beauty palace or a massage shop or a Chinese restaurant or um, you know a, a restaurant or like a grocery shop I don't know and also there's no direction for me to work out in a way is the best position to place that the cash register however there are a few general principle we need to obey and uh, I will show you this principle here so I feel like if your shop is like that then then of course it's, it's very good and um, then you can place the cash register more close to, let's say it's there here the door is here more close to the more close to the door do not place let's say if the, the shop has some missing corner here right let's say the shop has some missing corner then don't play on this sector here because this sector if you you draw on a bar gua here the sector is missing so that that particular gua the the chi or the energy or the strength is not strong enough okay so don't place close or near to that uh, missing gua area secondly is don't place under a beam under beam or something very suppressed thirdly place your cash register able to see you're able to see the door able to see the door and even if outside the door there there's like a, let's say a T in the section there and you place the cash register ideally able to see the incoming chi let's say the chi flow this way then uh, then it's a missing corner there then we, we don't consider it so if the, the chi is flowing from this way right then you can set the cash register here so to, to collect to get this chi so that this incoming chi is coming for you um, I had a, a, a friend of mine he she, she has a, a, a restaurant but I did not did I did not uh, did his uh, her feng shui but she changed the cash register position which is looks like this before before the business was not not really you know doing quite well so they the, the business need to dissolve the business was putting the cash register under a staircase under a staircase so it's really um, suppressed you know so the 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 entrance is is actually here and that's inside the shop here like that oh, it's not that it's not not really that big you know just like, like that so a friend of mine she bought the business and uh, then she changed the cash register just here very tiny cash register and the cash register is looking to the door facing the door coming in and because this is the road and the chi flow this way the energy flow this way so the cash register is able to receiving the chi what we call the incoming chi or, or, or you know incoming you know direct incoming chi so after her in the renovation the shop the kitchen still in the same spot she just you know renew the the restaurant the decoration put the counter register there and move in and she had a, a very good business uh, i did not do this uh, business 
but uh, you know you can observe you know the other things you observe you know if you go to some shops you know see they are very busy and then you, you, you observe you know, where their cash register is and that's uh, one way you can you know learn from your observation then if let's say you have a, a shop like this then we the, the, the door is here then you want to you know put the cash register here to or, or you know the counter here to receive the energy the other way is that there is uh, some unseen energy as well which is unique to using the calculation uh, for the uh, this place so it is uh, it, it's really quite hard to 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 make it perfect but generally uh, we say we we avoid the fill points which is we don't want to put it in the missing corner sector we don't want to put it under the beam and then we want to make sure we receive receive the chi you know when you're sitting at the cash register area you can see out to the outside so we bring in the outside chi to the cash register and i i hope this uh, short video will help you thank you